You might have seen videos or photos about tongue tie and then look at the mirror and think that you also have one. But the truth is, everybody has that little string underneath the tongue and it's called the lingual frenum. Everybody has it and it's completely normal to have. A tongue tie is not about having a frenum, but it's about restrictions. So you have to see if does the tongue has the mobility that it should, can you rest the tongue against the palate, can you swallow without any compensation? Because when the tongue is restricted, it doesn't just affect the speech or swallowing, it can also create a tension that radiates down the jaw, neck, and even the shoulders. That is because the tongue is connected through a network of fascia that can reach all the way down the body. Research also shows that kids with tongue ties are more likely to snore or have sleep disordered breathing. And in adults, a low tongue posture has been linked to disrupted sleep, snoring, clenching, and even sleep apnea. So that's why a proper mouth functional therapy assessment is important because not every frenum needs to be released. And what matters the most is if that restriction is affecting function, the breathing, the swallowing, speech, posture, and even the comfort. So before jumping into conclusions, get evaluated because a dentist or malfunctional therapist can help you see if therapy alone can help or if the tongue tie release is truly needed.